Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Beautiful. I must say, like, when you start speaking, it's so easy to like, to just go into it and drown into it. It's, it's amazing. <laughs> um, there's, there's a term that you use in, um, in one of your classes, like birth vision or birth plan. Can mm -hmm. you say something about that? Birth vision. Yeah. Um, yeah. this is a part of inner dance since, um, since, yeah, p before I've been a part of it. Uh, mm. but definitely a, a thought, a question, an expression that is rooted in a returning to the remembrance and birth vision is talked about in various philosophies and theories and histories and mythologies um, from around the world. It is related to that understanding of consciousness before you have a body, before you have a name, before you experience your actual physical birth, um, what in your spirit, in your essence, in the vibration of who you are, even before you had a name, is also in some way guiding or driving or acting as a motivational force for your life. And, and maybe we start to look at this in our own life through astrology or numerology, um, things like human design are now used to understand like how are all of these potential charges organized in our own system and 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 so in what way before you were born was all of this energy organized before it had to like get situated into the the nuances of how it would play out yeah um in what way before there was ever a trauma was the innocence of you in an expression of divine love also feeling what that might look like on a planet in a body um in relation to an experience that we call mm. human life and mm. can we fulfill that can we remember it can we remember this yeah this 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 purity this this divine element um in our lives or have we forgotten it yeah and i think traumatic birth can quickly make us forget birth visions. Um, challenges in childhood can make it hard to feel the innocence of being small and being in a, in a very pure state when love is, it's not just tangible. It's like, it's everything until somehow life takes it away more and more. <laughs> mm -hmm. So, when we connect back, especially to this feeling of pure love, um, that's so much greater than just what is human love. And mm. I think that also helps us to remember what this birth vision energetically might be like. Um, so even if we can't feel as though everything we do <laughs> in our life meets what the vision was, um, at least it's, it's, it's like, there's a, a memory of what we'll return to once this is over. 